Hi everybody, Matt back with you. Uh, today I've just walked up from Hebden Bridge towards Hepton Stall. Uh, I've come up one of the steepest paths in history. Uh, it's known as the Buttress. Out of breath. But the reason I've come up today is to have a quick look at a graveyard I've never actually been in before. Uh, it's called Cross Lanes Methodist Church Graveyard. So once you've headed up here, you find a graveyard. And it's kind of the halfway point between Hebden and Hepton Stall. Uh, and a church was built here um, between the two uh, villages um, to provide a church for kind of that midway point. Now this photo is from the Alice Longstaff collection, uh, held by Pennine Horizons. Um, this shows the chapel, uh, which would have been, I'll say roughly where that house is. Uh, it was built, I think, about the 1840s it opened. Um, unfortunately, when the First World War happened, uh, 25 members of the congregation lost their lives. And uh, that was about the end of the chapel. And by 1960, the chapel was empty and had actually then been destroyed by fire. I mean, let's just have a very quick look. So obviously there's been no burials here for quite some time. A lot of these graves are not particularly easy to read anymore. Uh, I've noticed in quite a few graveyards recently, newer graves like this one have appeared. And obviously this is somebody linked with, um, well actually, somebody who fought uh, in the First World War, I imagine. The Duke of Wellington's regiment. And I've seen these kind of graves appear um, in a few places. So I'm not sure if this was an initiative to uh, recognise uh, people who fought in the war. If you know, perhaps you could let me know. What it does have is a rather nice view of Hebden, going up to Birch Cliff. Unfortunately, the graves, as you can see, are very close together, quite overgrown, so I can't really get near any specific ones today to have a look. But yeah, it's another one of those forgotten graveyards. Okay, see you very soon for the next video. Take care.